remember most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone has blanketed that affection, who for thy honor was not thy intercession, but was led by thee, inspired by this confidence, I fly to thee, O Virgin of Virgins, command. To thee do I come with four years ten, sinful and sorrow. O Mother of the Word, despise not the patricians, but in your clemency, hear your wisdom. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth will proclaim your praise.
once favored your land and revived the fortunes of Jacob. He forgave the guilt of your people and covered all their sins. You have heard in all your age. You calmed the heat of your anger. Revive us now, God our helper. Put an end to your grievance against us. <coughs> Will you be angry with us forever? Will your anger never cease? Will you not restore again our life, that your people may rejoice in you? Let us see, O Lord, your mercy, and give us your saving help. I will hear what the Lord God has to say, a voice that speaks of peace. Peace for his people and his friends, and those who turn to him in their hearts. His help is near for those who fear him, and his glory will dwell in our Mercy and faithfulness have met, justice and peace have embraced. Faithfulness shall spring from the earth, and justice look down from heaven. The Lord will make us prosper, and our earth shall yield its fruit. Justice shall march before him, and peace shall follow his steps. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give to you. The Spirit is the witness, because the Spirit Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God, have mercy on me, Lord, for I cry to you all the day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord. For to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiving, full of love to all who fall. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer, and attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will call, and surely you will reply. Among the gods there is none like nor will to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you, and glorify your name, O Lord. For you are great and do marvelous deeds, you who alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way, so that I may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The crowd have risen against me. Fruitless men seek my life. To you they pay no heed. But you, God of and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me, O give your strength to your servant, and save your handmaid's son, show me a sign of your favor, 
that my flows may see to their shame, that you console me and give me your Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. The Spirit is a witness, because the Spirit is the Let your light shine before men, that they may give glory to your Father. In days to come, the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established as the highest mountain, and raised above the hills. All nations shall see your glory. Many people shall come and say, Come, let us climb the Lord's mountain to the house of the God of Jacob, that he may instruct us in his ways, and we may walk in his paths. For from Zion shall go forth instruction, and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. He shall judge between the nations, and impose terms on many peoples. They shall beat their swords into plowshares, and their spears into brooding hooks. One nation shall not raise the sword against another, nor shall they train for war again. O house of Jacob, come, let us walk in the light of Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Let your light shine before men, that they may give glory to your Father. Truth. 
She knows that.
Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord Jesus Christ, through life of the world, you guide all mankind to salvation. Give us the courage, strength, and grace to build a world of justice and peace, ready for the coming of that kingdom, where you live and reign with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to Behold the hand made of the Lord. Faith be done unto me according to thy word. And the word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ, thy Son, was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen.